letters and numbers through tangram. In this video, we will learn to make letters and numbers through a tangram. Bunny is thinking that Tuk Tuk is very clever. Every time he impresses me with his cleverness. Let me check his cleverness one more time. So Bunny asks a riddle to Tuk Tuk. I am an English alphabet. I am the first alphabet of an animal that loves to eat bone. And I am the last alphabet of the food item that is eaten with jam. Do you know who I am? Can you make me with the help of these shapes? Students, do you want to help Tuk Tuk? Wonderful! Then you can pause the video and try to solve the riddle. Come, let's see what happens next. Tuk Tuk starts thinking and after some time he says the English alphabet is D and I can make it with the help of these shapes. Then Bunny gets surprised and says how? Tuk Tuk says Bunny, the animal that loves to eat bone is dog and the food item eaten with jam is bread. So the first letter of dog and the last letter of bread is D. So the English alphabet is D. Now look at these shapes. There are two small triangles, one medium sized triangle, two large triangles, a square and a rhomboid. These are pieces of a tangram. So these shapes can be arranged to make an English alphabet D. For this, first I will give numbers to these shapes. Like this. Now, I will keep the shapes 1 and 2 like this. And then I will keep the shapes 4 and 6 like this. And at last, I will keep the shapes 5, 3 and 7 like this. See, in this way, I have made the English alphabet D. After hearing this, Bunny says, Amazing Tuk Tuk, you are very clever. But tell me, can we make all English alphabets with tangram? Then Tuk Tuk says, Yes, we can make all English alphabets with tangram. Also, let me tell you that we can make numbers with tangram. Let me show you. Once again, for our ease, I will give numbers to these shapes. Now, to make a zero, I will keep the shapes 2 and 6 like this. Then, I will keep the shapes 4 and 1 like this. And at last, I will keep the shapes 5, 7 and 3 like this. So in this way, I have made the number 0. Similarly, for making numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9, I will arrange these shapes like this. So with the help of tangram, we can make numbers also. Isn't it interesting? Bunny said, yes, and it is very useful for kids. I will give this tangram to Appu. This will increase his problem solving and logical thinking skills. Then Tuk Tuk said, yes, Bunny. You are right. So students, I hope you understood how to make letters 
n numbers through tangram. Now you can also try to make letters and numbers in a different way using tangram. Thanks for watching this video. See you later.